Hi, this is Justin from Hotspot Nymphing, and today I'm tying a tag nymph. Tag nymphs have a bright butt of some sort. This one uses glow bright, which is a very popular option. Here I'm fishing a tag nymph with my friend Larry in a Tennessee mountain stream. The tag nymph is a good choice because it combines a natural and flashy look perfectly. Little wild rainbows and brooks tend to be pretty opportunistic and love tags. The stream is a little high and a tag stands out in high or off color water. The CEC collar also has some good movement and slightly jigging this fly in slower eddies can be very effective. I'm using a Dohiku jig hook in a size 18 and a Hanuk 3mm slotted bead in silver. For thread I'm using Vivis 14 knot in brown B09. Start that just behind the bead and cut off the excess. For the tag, I'm using glow bright number four, double it over, then tie it in at the bead and pull back the top strands so that the tag is four pieces of glow bright. For the rib, I'm using UTC extra small silver wire to match the bead. And for the body, I'm using three strands of natural pheasant tail. Wrap the pheasant tail up to the bead, keeping the body as thin as possible. Then counter wrap the pheasant tail with the wire. For some movement, I'm going to make a CDC collar. First make a dubbing loop and then take just a little bit of done CDC and put it in your clip. Then put the CDC in the dubbing loop and spin it up. Wrap the dubbing loop and tie it off. For a collar, I'm using Peacock Black Ice Dub. Just use a little bit to keep the CDC in place. Whip finish and coat the exposed thread wraps and glue for durability. Tie some tags up, mix and match some colors. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more fly fishing and fly tying content. I don't always make videos when I get out and if you want to see what I've been catching recently, you can find me on the old Instagram at hotspotnymphing. I appreciate the support.